When does the music that keeps your pep in your set become too loud and cause your hearing loss? It seems almost impossible to walk around campus without bumping into someone without an iPod, MP3 player, or Walkman. As people walk to a beat, many drown out chatter by blasting their music. Audio devices that we use every day could lead to permanent hearing loss. Speech and hearing specialist Kim LeBlanc explains the permanent risk of high volumes affecting hair-like cells in your ears. Hair is similarly to an old toothbrush, and once they're gone, they're gone. And as they, as they start to go away, you lose your sensitivity to sound volume, but most importantly, you lose your ability to understand speech. In order to keep students from damaging cells in your ears, the Speech and Hearing Clinic offers special noise-canceling headphones to keep down outside distractions.